Hey, good morning. Welcome to the Gospel of Luke. We're at Luke 17, today, verses 22 through 25. Let's read it. Then he said to the disciples, The days will come when you will desire to see one of the days of the Son of Man, and you will not see it. And they will say to you, Look here, or look there. Do not go after them or follow them. For as the lightning that flashes out of one part under heaven shines to the other part under heaven, so also the Son of Man will be in his day. But first he must suffer many things and be rejected by this generation. So Jesus has a warning here. You're looking for all these signs and you're expecting all this glory. But guess what? There's a whole bunch of negativity and rejection ahead for us. And Jesus is telling his disciples ahead of time, don't expect we're going to, you know, walk into Jerusalem and it's going to be the big parade because they are going to murder Jesus and try to murder his disciples when he gets there. So this is the way it works out here. And yet God is, is giving us the, the warning. He's being faithful. He's showing us the way. But the way of the kingdom is not just a smooth way. It's not all, it's not all coated with velvet and, and uh, greased with, with, with olive oil. The way of the kingdom is, is hard. The way of the kingdom is going, you're going to meet a lot of resistance because there are two kingdoms vying. There is a great controversy between Christ and Satan. They want our hearts. Satan wants to destroy Jesus wants to redeem. Jesus wants to transform. And so it is, uh, it is not going to be an easy walk. When you become a Christian, you enlist God on your side. He is going to strengthen you and be your helper. But it doesn't mean it's going to suddenly become easy. Now the devils are going to redouble their effort, but now you'll have Jesus and his power on your side. Let's pray. Father in heaven, thank you for the uh, fair warning. Fair warning that there are stiff storms ahead if we follow you. But Lord, that is going to be worth it. Heaven will be cheap enough no matter what price we pay because you've paid the ultimate price. Help us, Lord, in our daily battles, in our overcoming, in our needs and necessities. Help us to just be basic Christians and we will give all the praise to you. Help us, Lord, not to expect easy stuff on the way. Prepare our hearts. For the intense pieces ahead, we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. So there it is, friend. We want to be true to him, and he will certainly be true to you. He will even bless you day by day as we walk with Jesus.